Hello everybody, this is Black Shadow 2525 and welcome back to the next episode of Path Out. So now, let's go ahead and move this mouse out of the way and go ahead and um, figure out how to get the the tank out. But I better, best I go and talk to Uncle though about this stuff because I'm not sure what to do. How was your search? You need help? Some help? Yeah, please. Don't forget the janitor lives in the upstairs apartment to the right. He has the hose. You can find the canister on the streets. Just go out of the yard. I saw it standing there a short while ago. Oh, okay, that's what I was supposed to get next. No, I'm fine, thank you. I just walked into you by accident. But I guess it's just out in the streets. Actually, hold on, I want to check about this. I don't think I've ever seen a, a fa the fountain here. Nope, never mind. So I guess we'll just head out here. Okay, so I guess that's the gas canister. I think this is the canister my uncle mentioned. Okay. Okay, it looks like that's one of the army. So now since we got the gas canister, let's go ahead and uh, head back down to the workshop and go and get it. Let's see here. Here goes nothing. Let's get the fuel. Done. Time to get going. That was quick. No sound effects. You got some awesome Syrian gas gasoline. Awesome then. I guess everything's awesome though in Syria, but probably not. So I guess now we should talk to Uncle again, or should we just leave? I will call him now. Go say goodbye to your parents. Take good care of yourself. I will miss you. Okay. Yeah, I guess we gotta say goodbye. It's time. My boy, take good care of yourself. Once you're with your brother, everything will be fine. We are going to miss you. Don't forget your phone, and do call us. I need to run. I'll call as soon as I can. Hello, young man. Do you have the fuel? Here it is. 15 liters of finest Syrian gasoline with extra water. Great. That should be enough to get north. To go north. Are you ready to go? No, I'm not, but I have to. Stay frosty. You'll make it out of this hellhole. I still remember this moment. Sitting in the van, driving away. Suddenly, everything you see is... is, is it has a meaning. This is your childhood. This is your, your, your neighborhood. This is your city. You're saying goodbye to everything. And you're saying to yourself, where am I? Where am I going now? To where? And why? Why there's war? Why? Like, you would wish that this never happened before. You, you would realize the... What, what the world... What, what the war made to Syria and to your country. Mm. Uh oh. But we are, kid. Can't get you further than this checkpoint. But it's still a long way. How will I get to the border? Someone will wait for you on the north on the other side of the village. You need to get past the fanatics there. He'll be waiting at the edge of the forest. Isn't this very dangerous? This is war, nothing I can do. Good luck, kid. Okay. Kurds hold the road to the east. The fanatics 
are controlling access to the northern. This is restricted territory, can't let you go through without papers or a very good reason. I need to go north urgently. What is your business up north? Ah, uh, okay, so I could say go to Turkey or bring medicine to relatives. But if we say that, would he check and see though if we have medicine? Or go to Turkey? I'm gonna say this though. Hmm, perhaps we can find a solution. How about a donation from from the local regiment? That would be a good idea. Here you go. Thank you. Okay, I guess we're allowed to pass now. Hopefully there's no mines around here. I guess there's a playground. Oh, one place is destroyed. An untouched playground in the war in a war zone, but all the children are gone. An untouchable playground, war zone. Okay, I guess it's nothing. Hmm. What if I go in here? Would it be a bad idea? School's out for summer. Is this supposed to be school or something else? Hmm. I wonder where all the students have gone. Hopefully they are far, far away. Probably, hopefully they are. Well, I guess there's nothing here. Well, this is the school then. Oh no, an our camel. Come on, guys. <sighs> no camels, okay? Not even a dip. I think I prefer the dead camel to this. <laughs> yeah, that is sad though. So, where do I supposed to go then? Might want to stay away from that. Hmm, there's something there. Hmm, someone lost their phone. Okay, I guess that's nothing. People have trashed and looted this place. Say anything about this sign? Nope. I had a feeling though about that camel though, like, there gotta be something there. Hmm. This one must be a grocery store or something. Milk seems to be spoiled. Yeah, this is an old store. Well, not old, just trashing. They don't seem to have my favorite cook cookies in stock. Yeah, of course. This place is rather bad selection. Out of everything. <laughs> okay. This place is rather bad selection. Well, because of this war though, man. It's all messed up. This place is rather... yeah. Okay, I guess there's nothing here. So did that death actually was a bad thing though at the beginning of the story? Seems like the other side is occupied by Isis and their cronies. 
best be careful. That's, okay, so that's occupied by Aisha, so I gotta stay away from, I should maybe stay away from that. It looks like there's mines there, though. Seems unlikely that the owner in this wheelchair got out alive. Hmm. Okay, I guess there's nothing there. Big gash here. Looks like there's a tunnel down, down there. I could go down. I want to stay up a little bit before I do. Shall I go down into the tunnel? No. Looks what we look what we have here. Look what we what you have done to your land and its people, bastard. I wonder, did you really say that? Well, it's supposed to be a true story, so... Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and check the cemetery. I heard about the ancient Moscow tourists used to come here. Our hopes and dreams for a better future are buried here. As it all says, wives without husbands, children without fathers, husbands without wives. A field of te tears and sorrows. Wives without husbands. I think this is all it says though. Our hopes and dreams. Yeah, I think this is all it. Most of these grades are quite new. Okay. So, I should check this place because I... Or have I already checked it out? Yeah, I have. I'm already forgetting where the locations are. So, there's a big hole there, but there's also a hole inside that building right there. I should check that out. Shall I go down into the tunnel? Yeah. A secret tunnel. The villagers must have built to hot to hide from the war. That's quite the mining operation down here. This lead probably to another building though. It might be across where ISS is. Oh, okay. So that's where the mines are. So I gotta be careful of those. So that one mine that I walked in though and stuff that probably would never happen, but it might. Oh. Okay, I guess we gotta make sure not to get caught by these people. Can I sprint in this? Nope, doesn't seem like it. Pose. Big lamp. sneaker if I go past this guy. I 
gotta wait until he walks a little bit more further away. Oh crud. Please don't shoot. Ah darn it. Alright. This is not funny anymore. When you are dead, your sister's tears will dry as time goes on. Your window's tears will cease in another arms. But your mother will mourn you until she dies. Okay, so I guess that was a big mistake. I didn't know if, uh, like, how far he would have uh, turned. I should have waited a little bit. Okay, so I guess going there was a bad option. Hmm. Then where should I go? Okay, I can't go there. I forgot to have mines. They're right there, though. Okay, I guess I could just go and pass in there. Okay, that's mines right there. Oh, okay. Okay, I guess I should just keep on going north. Okay, I think that might be our brother. Are you the driver that that takes me to the border? Yes, good that you made it past the checkpoint. Wasn't easy. Shall we go? Sure. Do you have the money? Money? What money? Aren't you a friend of my uncle? Look, kid, these are dangerous times. Can't take a risk without some compensation. I'm sorry, I only have a little cash and I need it for turkey. That's too bad. You better start walking. Should take you a day or two. Listen, can't you at least get me a little closer? Maybe I could do a small detour, but you'll have to walk the last bit. Thanks. What a bastard. Yeah, this guy is I don't jerk. trust this guy. Uh, in reality, I didn't. Because they would tell you things that they are not real and they would not give you proof of it. Like, for example, when I was in the van, he didn't allow me to use my phone. So I can't see where I am with the GPS or something. Um, he would tell you things like, for example, uh, it's just two minutes of walking when we arrive. And that's not true, it could be two hours of running. And still, you don't know where he takes you. So, that was a really hard one. Ah. That's it. You are almost there. Really? Where do I go? Either way should be fine. Just don't walk into the mines. There are a few around. Mines? Anything else that might kill me? Yes, soldiers will shoot on sight here. But you should be fine. Just go around them. If you say so. How far is it? Just a stroll. Nothing serious. A friend will be waiting at the river. Tell him that you took the bus. The bus? Okay, if you say so. Exactly. This is how they will trick you. They would tell you like, hey man, it's right over the corner, right there, but it's not true. It's not true. You, you have to find it. You have to walk your, your way to it. That's how it is. Eh, okay. So I guess now we got a couple of ways that we gotta go, but sadly that we gotta end it there because I am out of time in this episode, so I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode of Path Out where we're...
trying to get the turkey then. So, I'll see you guys then. Black Shadow 2525, signing out.